We will in this video cover the following. What's a round sling? How does it work? Safety factor. 7 to 1. Several different ways to lift items with a round sling. Great to know. And at the end, pros and cons when using a round sling compared to alternatives. What's a round sling? Round sling, or in rare cases as some would prefer to call them, soft sling, is a lightweight lifting tool. It consists of internal load-bearing strands, which is composed of 100% durable polyester fibers that are woven in a continuous loop with a protective cover wrapped around. It's endless because the ends are put together, so it makes a circle. Someone would maybe at first impression confuse round sling with the webbing sling, but they are two different products who with a first glance just would look like each other. If you want to hear about webbing slings, or just web slings as some would prefer to call them, then feel free to leave a comment below and let me know. How does it work? A round sling works by attaching to a shackle or a hoop. It can be used as an extender for cases where chains are just not long enough, but you will often see them wrapped around an item for general transportation. There are several ways to lift items with a round sling. I'll cover that after the next chapter. Safety factor 7 to 1. All lifting equipment in the European Union must be CE approved. We have different certificates and guidelines to live up to depending on where in the world we are, whereas safety factor 7 to 1 is a worldwide safety factor and it basically means that the, for example, purple round sling who with a straight lift is allowed to lift 1000 kilograms will not break before it reaches 7 times the allowed lifting weight. In this example, it may not break before reaching 7000 kilograms. Several different ways to lift items with a round sling. How much you can lift with a round sling depends on how you choose to lift. There are several ways to lift items with a round sling. The first method is straight. The second method is laced. The third method is with a U-lift. The fourth method is with a U-lift 45 degrees. The fifth method is with a U-lift 45 to 60 degrees. The sixth method is with a U-lift 90 degrees. And the seventh method to lift items with a round sling is with a U-lift 120 degrees. The U-lift method is the lift who can handle most weight compared to the alternative methods in relation to the safety factors 7 to 1. A purple round sling with the method with the lowest strength is laced, which only can handle 800 kg. The straight method can lift 1000 kg, but with the U-lift method it can lift the double 2000 kg. U-lift with degrees will at 45 degrees be able to lift more than the straight method, but a little less than the U-lift without the 45 degrees. As we go further and increase the degrees, the fewer kilogram it can handle. When we hit 120 degrees in a U-lift, the round sling is then able to lift the same weight as when using the straight method. Great to know! You must never overload, lift calmly, and avoid sharp jerks, avoid sharp edges, pay attention to friction damage. No polyester lifting equipment tolerates alkaloids chemicals. Worn or damaged lifting gear must never be used. Polyester can't lift items warmer than 80 degrees Celsius. Check the equipment regularly for damages or wear and tear. And never use webbings at a temperature below minus 40 degrees and above 100 degrees Celsius. Pros and cons when using round sling compared to alternatives. Pros. Round sling is great to tasks where the items who is being transported need a gentler handle. An example could be that a wire would destroy the paint or cut into the thing it moves and therefore a round sling would be better suited for the task's requirement. Because the round sling is round, the never-ending design gives the opportunity to change wear points on every lift, which let the round sling last longer in relation to not change wear points, can be manipulated in several ways, color-coded, immediately identifiable, lightweight, Durable and flexible, cheap compared to alternatives. Cons Polyester round slings are more influenced by wear and tear compared to chains. If you know other pros and cons, please let me know which below in the comments. Thank you for watching.